Okay, hey, it's me, Erica, again, and this is another one of my videos, and um, I have a new updo. Um, this is my new hairstyle that I wanted to share with you guys, and um, the reason of this hairstyle is because I wanted to find something that was a little more elegant, um, something that you can wear to work. Okay, um, all right, rewind. What's been happening since my last video? I had a little catastrophe. Um, my hair on this side, I decided to get it pressed. I think you all saw my pressed video, which was the 10 things that I learned about being natural. And um, I pressed it and it wouldn't go back to curly. Um, so I, I'm gonna do a video about that too, but I need something to try to hide this side right here. So this is an updo. Um, what it is, <coughs> is a French braid in the back and I mean a French roll gosh in the back and um, I've just secured it with bobby pins I did it while my hair was still wet I um, it was very damp and that way it was more pliable more easy to uh, wrap it around here to the side and then I just twisted it up continue twisting it up like you're doing a um, one of those like flat twists but it's just one flat twist so you're going to keep twisting it up twisting it up until you get to the top and then you're going to secure with bobby pins and i wanted it kind of to the side some so that's how i did it to the side okay so the products that i used were i used three different types of bobby pins this time last time my other video i just used this bobby pin which is um the bobby pin that that like has these little crinkles in this flat side and it's really tight and this one works really good for securing it but I mean like getting it those little flat edges but this bobby pin right here that I use which is this one is really good for pinning your hair in place and if your hair is starting to get you know like a little longer these right here work great they don't have any little tips and they're really good for pinning it your hair in place um just to keep your style you know okay and then I also use this really big one and I use these in the middle of my hair and those I use to to keep that roll tight like to keep the roll going right there really tight so I of course I use the quick curls the Miss Jessie quick curls again and I'm just using it till it runs out I've got some other stuff that I'm gonna try because this stuff is super expensive and I won't be buying it again until I probably won't be buying it again if I can find a replacement that's a lot cheaper and if I do I'll share that with you guys too and the other thing that I use is the Eco Styler gel it's a dollar ninety nine and you get 16 ounces of it so that's a really good you know buy for bang for your buck and what to get these smooth edges like really smooth just take a toothbrush <laughs> like an old toothbrush or you know buy a toothbrush whatever from the dollar store and lightly brush these edges up I wouldn't recommend using a really big brush like I also have this huge wave brush it's about like this big and I wouldn't use it only because when you want those edges to be tight that big brush is going to do too much and then I kind of just pull out you know parts that I wanted like around here so let me got let me let you guys see it in slow motion Gosh. okay so that's a really quick style that you can do it probably is going to take you about 10 to 15 minutes I try to keep these styles under 10 to 15 minutes because um, they're quick and easy styles that you can wear to work or to the office or if you're a professional or you know you have a hot date or you you know you're going natural and you want to find something that you can do that's going to be a protective style but isn't going to be uh, you know the flat twist or just the norm then this is something quickly that you can do that hopefully can spruce up your look and you'll still look elegant and neat and I'm really big on neat styles. So I hope you guys enjoy. I thank you all for subscribing. I thank you all for your um, words of encouragement and for um, sending me comments and suggestions and, and telling me that you like my makeup. That makes me really happy. And um, just uh, continue to watch I hope and I hope you get something from this video and I thank you guys for watching and I hope that you enjoy it okay have a good day 
Oh, the name of my channel is Naturica. Gosh, I forgot that. 